Hi guys, welcome back to our channel All Sorts of Stuff where we do all sorts of stuff. Today we're going to be doing a Christmas gift haul. So we've got quite a few things from a few different places so we're just going to go through and show you one place at a time. So first we're going to show you what we got from the works. So the works actually do quite a lot of things that are two for ten, so uh, two products for ten pound. And they actually have quite a lot of stuff on there, so they have like colouring books, uh, make your own sets, science sets, and games, books, like all sorts of different stuff and they actually have quite a lot of things in the shop that are 2 for 10. So you could easily find so many things for people, uh, for children, you know, everything for Christmas really cheaply. So first I'm going to show you this. So this is a make your own bling soap and as you can see here it's got the 2 for 10 pound sticker on it. And um, so what this is, is you basically, you could make your own soap but you add uh, gems and little sparkly things and then you also make soap on um, rings. So you get the rings and you make soap on it. I'm going to open this and show you what's inside. So this is what the inside looks like, so you get a set of instructions and then you get three coloured fragrances so you get a red cherry fragrance a yellow lavender fragrance and a blue blueberry fragrance and then you get one plastic mold which is this one here and as you can see it's got like hearts and stars and all sorts of different things on there and then you get three plastic rings which are here and we'll get like i'll show you flower shape and then there's just a crown shape and star shape also uh, you get some clear soap, a block of clear soap. You get one mixing beaker, which has also got measurements on it, so it's got millilitres and ounces on it. And you get some gloves, so your hands don't get messy. Some white soap, and then just three little star gems. So next we got this body and bone science set, so as you can see this one is another 2 for 10 item. So in this one you make your own human body experiment, so you like mould a skull and paint paint, paint your moulded skull, so you can see all the different body parts and things like that. So we'll open this and have a look what's inside it. This is what it looks like inside, so again you get an instruction leaflet and you get one card skeleton with stand which I think is that in there um, one internal organ play mat which must be that mat there which is holding all that in which is falling out uh, you get three paint pots which are there so you get pink, purple and red uh, two packs of magic dough so this is white dough and red dough, wood paintbrush which is there, one skull mould, one bag of foam bones which are there, one adhesive strip which is that strip and that's everything that you get in here. Really quickly before we carry on, uh, this is for ages 7 plus and this one is for ages 8 plus and also uh, all the mix and match items so all the ones that are 2 for £10 if you just buy one of them it costs £7 just for one or two for next we have again another 2 for £10 item so this is a kaleidoscope neon colouring kit butterflies and more it's like a colouring book uh, it, said this, it says this kit includes 6 neon markers and a 64 page book so as you can see the neon marker there you get orange, blue, yellow, pink, green and purple. So when you open it this is what it looks like on the inside. And then this colouring book is just basically opens upwards and then as you can see all, oops, try that again, all of these different patterns in there where to colour it. Jazz you can also get that book in different designs. Yes, you can. So I think they had uh, an animal one. I think there was a tattoo one. Yeah. I think there was a tattoo one and then just like a random one. I'm sure there were like four different ones in there. And then there's also some that are not neon ones as well. So they, had, they did have quite a few different uh, varieties of this one. 
And actually, if you look on the back here, it says the price, it says £12.99. So we got two for £10, so technically we already paid £5 for this, so that was a bargain. And this does not say what age it's for. I'm guessing older child, maybe teenager would enjoy doing this. Even adults would like doing this. So next we have got this hair braiding set. So again, another two for £10 item. So this says, the French braiding tool makes braiding simple. So there must be a, a French braiding tool in it, which there is, because it says here, includes 65 elastic hair ties. So I guess that's all these colourful ones here. Uh, a French braiding tool and a 48 page book with step-by-step -step instructions. And this is for ages six plus, but I really don't think a six year old would be able to do these hairstyles in here. Maybe if they were really good at it, they would be able to. So, that's the box that's got the elastics and the hair uh, French braiding tool in it. And then this is the book. So, we actually got this for ourselves because we thought, oh, we could try some hairstyles on each other. So, we might actually be making some future videos using this. So, as you can see, on this side, there's like... So this is the starting of one, so it's got the title, picture, and then the instructions, and it goes on to the next page, and then like with every instruction there's uh, a picture, so, which is really helpful because when you're doing it you're like, is that right, is that right, so at least you can see, uh, you know, how you're doing it, so, there will be a future video on this, so you will know how this works. So again guys, it actually says on here £14.99 so, but obviously we've got two for £10 so technically we only paid £5 for it so again another amazing bargain so next we've got this splatter face game so again two for £10 um, I think there's, this is a take on that game Pie, fa yeah, pie Face? Pie I think face it's called Pie Face but this is like, a, it's called splatter face but as you can see it's the same concept you put your cream on the little end thingy and then you push the buttons and it splats you in the face so that's this one um so this comes with interactive game cards so one of them says let me try and read this it says splatter face you lucky thing swap seats immediately and get your face out of the firing line <laughs> so it's like a game that you can play and then that says dare to put your face in it so there's a spinner as well so uh, you put your face in it, spin the spinner, and then you click the button however many times the spinner lands on. So, ooh, whipped cream, jelly or slime, you, desi you decide. Well, that's not provided, so it's not provided. Ooh. So, does this say age on it? Oh yes, this is uh, age 5 plus. So yeah, I'm sure kids will have a great time with this. I'm pretty sure everybody, right, has seen somebody do a pie face, but splat a face game challenge on YouTube because there's so many out there. So next we have this exploding booms, uh, weird science set. So this is another our last actually two for ten pound item. So this says create your own booms, bangs, and explosive energy. So with this you can make a volcano explode, build a mega fizz inflating balloon. Explode your own boom bags, launch a film canister rocket, and make exploding water bombs. So, I think this would be very fun for boys because you know they love doing stuff like that, and it's also a science as well, so they'll learn things at the same time. Um, this is for ages 8 plus, so let's have a look inside. This is what it looks like on the inside. So, we have got uh, one plastic volcano, which is this, one balloon. Oh, one balloon. There's actually two balloons in it. Three, three ba balloons. There's actually three balloons in there. It says one balloon on the box. Oh, no. Two of them are water bombs, actually. One's a balloon and two are water bombs. Then we've got one plastic funnel, one pack of baking soda, and one pack of baking powder. And then we've got two boom bags, which are these bags over here. Two boom bags, uh, two craft dies, which we've got a, a green die and a red die. We've got 
one film canister. I know what it means. You know, old film that used to go in cameras. Old film canister. Um, three rocket parts, which are in this little bag here. A pair of gloves and an instruction manual. So next we got this Christmas sticker and activity pack and this says over 1,000 stickers. So as you can see here it says includes four books and that is where the sticker was stuck over it. I really hate it when that happens. Uh, this is a little handle so you can carry it around. Uh, on the back it shows you what's inside so it says with four fantastic colouring books and over 1,000 festive stickers children will be entertained for hours at Christmas time. Fun puzzles, games and press outs make this the perfect gift for every child. So there's Christmas games, which is a Christmas sticker activity, activity fun, festive fun time, Santa's busy night and Santa's workshop. So this is for uh, children 3 plus. So we bought this for £1.99 and on the back it says there, it says £12.99 and we only bought this for £1.99 that is such a bargain so let's have a quick look inside so it's just got velcro pieces on it there the, this, the different books And then these are just all, I don't know how to show you, loads of uh, different stickers basically, Christmas stickers. So I don't know if you use the stickers in the book, oh no, this, all of them like press out so you press them out and then you can put them onto the play scene I guess. Well that, that's a Santa sleigh scene that one. Uh, there's special delivery, so you get instruction, rusty's ride. So it's basically just like loads of fun activities, which is actually really good to keep children entertained uh, over the Christmas season whilst they're not at school. <laughs> so the last thing that we got from the works is this putty. So these are called Genius Putties. So we'll have a look at this one first. So it says Genius Putty, and then it says Chameleon. So I'm guessing that this, well from the description on the website it sounds like that this putty changes colour because it's again chameleon. So this is for ages 3 plus and it doesn't really say anything else, anything about it on the container other than it has uh, warnings and that's pretty much it. So do not eat the item, keep away from hair. <laughs> so yeah that's that one but I think it's cool that it changes colour. And this one is, it says Genius Putty Heat Sensitive. So with this one, like I'm sure it's one colour and then once you put heat on it, maybe from your hands or uh, some other source of heat, it changes colour. So as you can see, it has this little colour coordinate thing on it. So I think this one changes from purple to blue. Maybe blue to purple, but I think purple to blue. And there was, there was like more colours, so I think there was some with green, some with pink, some with orange. So you just like choose your colour, whichever colour you want it to change to and from. Oh, and these were £4 each and they fitted just new plus. And there were also some different ones, weren't there? There was some with glitter in it. Yes. Um, what were they? Illuminous. Neon. Neon. Neon, yeah. yeah. Um, I think there were maybe like five different mm. ones. I don't... Did they have original, just normal putty? I'm not sure. I'm not sure, but it's genius putties. Oh, I think they did have magnetic putty. Magnetic putty, I think they had that. They just have like quite a few different ones. Um, right, so first I'm going to show you this uh, make your own sticker maker. So it's a sticker machine. Uh, this is from the company Chad Valley. So this uh, machine. So it says on here as well, no batteries required, which is actually really good because the worst thing you can do, right, is on Christmas Day when all the kids have opened the presents is not have no batteries so they can't play with anything. So this actually doesn't contain batteries so you don't have to worry about that. Um, so in this set, so it's a 16 piece set, so it contains one laminating machine, two rolls of clear laminate, two rolls of adhesive paper, one design sheet, one template sheet, four colour markers, 
one tape feeding tool, two spools, one paper press and one pair of scissors. So you actually get quite a lot in there. So I think what you do is you like you run your sticker through this section I'm thinking because that's the adhesive stuff it looks like that's the adhesive stuff and um, would you say that's the I really don't know just ah yeah it is I was right so as you can see there it look it shows you so it goes in this way and it comes out this side so by the time it gets from here to here it's a sticker I'm pretty sure children will love playing with this because all kids love stickers and it actually comes with a, a blank sheet so they can colour it in so that's what the markers are for so they can colour them ones in and then they've already got the pre-coloured ones so yeah I actually used to have a sticker machine it was actually really good so this is for six years plus and it was originally supposed to be so originally 11.99 and we got it to 15 pound so technically we paid seven pound fifty for this so the next product we got was actually the other item that we bought with the sticker machine so this was also another two for 15 pound item originally this was 9.99 which is still a really affordable price considering what you get so this is a really long one so we'll start with this one so it, they're actually all in uh, three different boxes so in this first box it's a jigsaw puzzle so it's a 24 piece jigsaw puzzle and uh, as you can see it's Paw Patrol themed so um, again like I said 24 piece jigsaw puzzle so this is suitable for children at 3 plus so that's the first one and the second one you get a game so this is a bit like what's the game? Ludo? no what's the game called? is it frustration? frustration I'm not sure I know there's one called catch me if you can yeah same kind of concept if you know what I mean but I think I think it's called Ludo frustration no it's not what it's Ludo Ludo I think it's leave it in the comments down below and let us know what the actual game is called so um that is that one so it's got a little popper in the middle which i think is really good some people might find it annoying but i think i think it's good especially for younger children because it's easier than rolling the dice because children just want to throw it across the room so you just pop it down find your number also really good for te teaching younger kids numbers counting uh, sharing and taking turns so i really like uh, this game again Paw Patrol themed and the last one is uh, some jumbo playing cards so it's just got all the cards you know with the hearts and the uh, diamonds and the spades and clubs. clubs they've got them on them but they have got the characters also so you can make this a lot easier you could play snap so then they could you know matching game so you don't have to think oh what are children going to do with some <laughs> playing cards I'm sure they're not going to play blackjack or anything like that maybe snap they'll enjoy looking at the uh, picture name the characters with the numbers uh, also another memory thing, games memory games yes you see turn them all around and try and match them so uh, I've just noticed on here so this one it says it's a two to four player game on oh they actually both do so these two both say two to four player games but yeah for well, even if you bought a signal, so it would be 9 99 signally, or if you bought 2 for 15, it would work out at £7.50. So, and you get three different ones in it, that is an uh, absolute bargain, especially for any child that loves Paw Patrol. Next, we've got this uh, VTech Baby uh, Tiny Top Driver. So, this is for ages 12 to 36 months. Uh, on here, it says uh, develop, oh, I can't even speak. developmental benefits. So, there's sensory development, fun melodies, sounds and phrases similar to your child's auditory senses, uh, there's a couple more on there, uh, imaginative play, motor skills, language development, so this is really good for younger children. This requires two AA batteries, <laughs> but actually it does, it does work, so I don't know how long them batteries will last though. Let's just turn that off for a second. Um, on the back it says teachers and features. So it's got three LED lights, three modes of play, uh, 
signal lever, interactive dog, five colourful buttons and concept of opposites. It's also got a parent friendly feature which is quite good actually. So let's just try and see a few things that it does. So we'll turn it back on. So it's got a mirror over there. Let's try one of the other levels. So how do we change the levels of this? Oh, it's over here. Oh, the signal lever's down here. And also, so as you can see, anyway, it does a lot of things. Even I enjoy playing with it, so I'm sure a little baby would enjoy playing with it too. Uh, and this cost sixteen pound ninety nine. We have this chocolate lolly maker by John Adams. Uh, it's ages six plus. So this says melt mold and wrap chocolate lollies. So as you can see, this says it's got all these different chocolate lollies on here. It says add secret messages, four lolly shapes, bag and wrap, lovely gift, uh, bags and bows. So on the back, it actually shows you the different steps. So melt your chocolate, choose your mold, add a message pop it out of the mould, wrap and tie and give to family or friends so quite easy, instruction right there on the box so in this also it says use any brand of chocolate buttons chocolate not included so you will have to buy the chocolate and it does recommend you buy chocolate buttons so the contents of this are a lolly wrapper, lolly moulds so you get a pony, a bunny, a hat and a flower uh, message moulds reusable sticks chocolate melting unit with spoon and stirrer and um, ribbon and bags for wrapping so that's this one and we bought this one for £16.99 I have more of like an adult kind of product so this is called top to toe treats it's uh, uh, by the brand 7th heaven so this has got right, how many does this have this? So it's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve different like mask kind of things. So there's face masks, peel off masks, uh, body masks kind of things, uh, foot masks. <laughs> it's got all sorts of different ones in it. So as you can see, it comes with this really nice tin. So let's have a quick look. So this was actually only £9.99 and they did have uh, two more similar to this. They just had like uh, different masks in them. One came in a basket and did the other one come in a tin as well? I think so, yeah. I think the other one came in a tin too. Right. <laughs> that is on there really tightly. I think one of them had hair masks yeah. in as well. Yeah, they did have different things. Right, so look, it's just tin which is really good because after you've used uh, the masks out of it you can use it to put whatever you want in it so this is what it looks like on the inside so let's just quickly have a look oh so this is like a double one so it's got a foot a foot soak and a foot lotion in it so yeah that looks really weird the package is actually <laughs> two feet and it does look really weird uh, another feet one so this is mint and iced blueberry feet Fresh feet cooling deodorizing. So, yep. So, actually, the fun thing is, I actually bought this for mum. I know she's seen it now, but oh well. So, I'm sure you'll enjoy having that on your feet, won't you? She hates her feet being touched, by the way. Uh, next, we have this uh, exfoliator and mask orange and black lava for smooth and soft looking skin. That's that one. So, they all have like the instructions on the back of them and all, and they're uh liquid ones so you can get oh actually this one's a sheet mask a dead sea sheet mask so it's got one inside it so that's that one her uh, oh strawberry cream moisturizing and toning hydrating mask so that one's actually that one. oh what's this one well i don't think you should be touching this one Coconut protein mask. Hair, oh, hair rescue. So it did, this one did have a hair one in it. Oh, better not use that while you're around then. 
Yeah, if you didn't know, I'm allergic to nuts and coconut. <laughs> Uh, another okay. So this is a peel off uh, mask. Oh, man, manuka, manuka, honey peel off uh, removes dead cells. Easy peel mask. Uh, oh, another hair rescue one. Strengthens damaged roots and dry hair. So this is this would be really good for you. Wouldn't it? Yeah, I could do that now actually. <laughs> My hair's dry. So oh god, another uh, creamy coconut one. For dry and tired skin. See, the thing is, right, this kind of stuff would be good for my skin because I have really dry skin, but I can't use coconut, and apparently, coconut is supposed to be really good for dry skin. Uh, oh, a passion one removes unwanted oils and protects easy peel masks. So, you know, this would be really good for like if you wanted like a girl's night, you know, to do masks and stuff because everybody's oh, yeah. got different skin, right? And there's literally stuff for everything. You could have a pamper party. Yeah, you with could. With your girlfriends. And it only costs £9.99 and you get a really nice tin out of it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, Red Hot Earth Sauna Mask. Oh, this is a distress one, yeah, Mum. <laughs> is that the one that warms, warms your face? Yeah. yeah. Warms and unclogs pores. Self heating therapy. Right, I, think I love are, them. These ones are really weird, they're getting hot They're the really face. good, I love them. So that's that one, the redhead one. <laughs> and the last one in here is a, oh this feels really weird, a goji, goji berry, body smoothie, possibly the best body moisturiser your skin will ever feel. So, and it says new on it as well, that one. So, that one. So yeah, as you can see, uh, you actually get quite a lot of stuff it's in it. It's a bargain it. for 9 99 so. That is, because you know masks can be really expensive mm. depending on where you get them from, so. And, especially for someone who really enjoys doing masks and stuff, it's really good. It's a great gift. So this next one is actually Mum's favourite, she absolutely loves it. So this is uh, a little red riding hood dress up. So this is actually for a little girl who loves dressing up, so I'm sure she'll love it. Um, this says child, four to six years. We did actually order three to five years, but four to six came and actually looks all right, so we didn't bother uh, changing it or anything. So I'll just open this up. And this was £17.99, I think. I think it was, yeah. Let's open it. So as you can see, the little girl on there. See, she's got the little... Um, so you get the, the dress bit and the... Uh, what do you call it? Okay. Hooded cape. Mm. Oh, so the cape's there in the bag, but let's show you. Oh, I love it. It's gorgeous. <laughs> this. Move it back, John. Yep. <laughs> it's so cute. So as you can see, it's really cute. And um, it's not actually one of them dress-ups that are like, you know, that are like really cheap and mm. that you would never let your child go out of the house in. This is actually really cute and it's really good quality and all, all the different materials and things like that. Like, like if I had a little girl she wore this, I'd let her go out of the house in it. Do you know what I mean? It actually looks decent, if you know what I mean. Like, um, I said, do you know what I mean? Way too many times in that sentence. Because we actually were looking for, um, so you know my, my little brother, Jamal, he just had a birthday not so long ago, so he turned four, and he really wanted a Hulk costume. And nowhere, we looked everywhere for a Hulk costume, and they were all like really bad quality. You know, and they, they just didn't look nice at all. Anyway, he ended up getting an Iron Man one, but still they were, and they, they weren't good quality. And this is just really, really good quality. So if you wanted a Red Riding Hood dress, we could have got him an absolutely gorgeous one. So this is really, really nice. So uh, now we are going on to the next store, which is Matalan. So we just got two things from uh, this store. So as you know, Matalan is a clothing store, but at Christmas they do uh, get some toy products and some other uh, products. I know last year we actually did get a few really nice things from there, so if you do have a look you can find some really nice things for actually quite cheap. There were some really nice things for the home. Oh yes, there was. There was like uh, Christmas decorations. Cushions but, like, and yeah, cushions. Throws. Think, yeah. There was, oh they did have a really nice nutcracker, <laughs> it was really nice. And they're all actually quite affordable prices there, mm. they are. So, well, we just got two toys from there, so we got this uh, Marvel's Avengers Turbo Copter. So you just put that bit onto that bit, 
and then oh, you pull the, it's got a little string there, so you pull it and the <coughs> helicopter bit just flies off. Kids absolutely love that kind of stuff and this was only £3, so that is a real good price that is. I've actually seen this somewhere else and I'm sure it looks more expensive than this, maybe it was like 4 99 or something, which is not that much, but when you're buying Christmas presents and you need to buy like for everybody, you know, two pound pounds, do you know what I mean? So that's that one. And then the other one is in the Avengers Assemble. So this is a, a disc shooter. So this little thing here, this plastic thing, clips onto the top of the gun shooter thing. It clips on there and then you put all your foam discs in it and what's really good is that they are foam so they're not plastic so when they do shoot around your house it's, not, it's probably not going to break anything. Uh, so this was also £3 as well so they were actually really good prices. Keep the kids entertained. So the next shop is, we haven't got much left actually. So the next shop is Home Bargains. A home bargains. Actually, this year it has got a lot more Christmas stuff. So it's got one, two, three, four different Christmas aisles. Well, this is in our local home bargains. So it's got like four different Christmas aisles. They've got all sorts of stuff uh, at really good prices, actually. Like they have the same stuff what you could get from like maybe Boots or Superdrug or somewhere, but a lot cheaper and really affordable. So at first, I saw this and I just had to get it. So, um, I saw it and I was like, I looked and I looked again and I had to look because of the price. Now the price said 99p. So I looked and I looked again and I like read the top and it said, you know, Iron Man money box. And I was like, really? So I was a bit like, 99p really? So anyway, we got to the checkout and everything and it actually was 99p for this. So it is um, an Iron Man money box. So let me just get it out of this for you. And look, it's what do you call that? What would you know? It's not plastic. It's, it's pot or something. Yeah, it's like pot. Like, do you call it porcelain or something? I don't know. No, oh, it's I don't not know. Porcelain, but but it's like you know, it's really nice. And there's the money box hole, and you can see that it's been painted as well. So underneath is a little um, stopper. I'm not gonna try and pull it out, but <laughs> that's the little stopper to stop the money coming out. So you actually don't have to break it to get into it because uh, actually when I, when I was looking at this um, Z, my husband, said to me but what do you have to break it to get into it? And I was like, but it's really cute, you can just like put it in a room but actually you don't because it's got a stopper there so for 99p, amazing and they only had about three left when I got this and uh, I hadn't seen it again so I think everybody snatched up that deal but maybe in some other home bargains, bigger ones stores, because it's not actually that big. Our local home bargain store isn't actually that big. They actually may get some more though. Yeah, they usually do. Um, do get stocking all the time. So that's that's that. So yeah. And next is this Beano Annual 2018. Now one thing is. I have got a Beano Annual, so I've said I'll buy it for myself, like uh, my mum usually buys it for me. Uh, a Beano Annual, every single year since I think 2014 maybe? 2014? Maybe longer. 14? 14. Oh no, not you 14. You mean 4? Yeah, maybe 4. 2004, yeah. Yeah, can't mean 14, 14, 15, 16, 17. Yeah, more than 3, more than 3. I've got like... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, maybe I've anyway. I've got like a full collection of Beano annuals. So every single year, my mum buys one for Christmas. So I haven't looked inside it. Don't worry, I ruined my present at all. Uh, I haven't looked inside it and think. But I got this from Home Bargains for two pound ninety nine. If I'm right, I think it was two pound ninety nine uh, from Home Bargains. And uh, depending on where you buy annuals, they can be quite expensive. Like if you bought them from like Double H Smiths. Mm like book chapter like that they usually are expensive but 2 99 you can't go wrong and on the back it does say £7.99 so for 2 99 it's great I'm never going to say no to a Beano annual every year I think Asda were doing 2 for £7 on that and a few other places yeah. as well yeah they do 
places do usually have offers mm. of annual trying to get you buy more but uh, and actually in home bike they did have like a full uh you know them square rack things they had like um full of different ones i know they had henry a one. book display jasmine yes a book display <laughs> a book display i love that they had the henry one a football one they just have all sorts so i'm sure if you just nip in and have a look you'll find some at really reasonable prices i'm dying to read this <laughs> So as last product is from New Look. So if you don't know, New Look is just like a clothing store. Um, so from there we've got this scarf. So I mean it's just a scarf. It's just it's a, a checked scarf with all the different colours. It's got the little um, what do you call it? Spring tassels. Tassels. And detailing on the end. Um, it's actually. <laughs> quite long look it opens up so that's how like thick it is so it's actually quite thick it's really nice material and if we can find the tag so I think yep yeah, this was £6.99 so not bad they had a full section so this was actually in uh, the white rose new look they had like a full uh, wall just full of um, scarves so they had all sorts of different ones they ranged in prices so this one was 6 99 so I'm sure you could find yourself a really nice winter scarf from New Look. That's it for this haul guys. I'm pretty sure we will probably be doing uh, another one or so uh, in the run up up until Christmas. So I really hope you enjoy watching this video. If you did give it a big thumbs up, subscribe and if you have any questions about any of these items just leave it in the comment section down below and I'll be sure to answer it. And we'll see you next time. Bye guys!